Angelica Alcala here. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Today I thought it would be fun for me to show you my arsenal of perfumes and tell you exactly what type of event I actually use them for. Yes, I am very specific with my perfumes and what I use them for because let's face it, every perfume has its own personality. So I'm gonna show you the six perfumes I swear by and what type of events I actually use them for. So we're gonna start off with perfume number one, and that is Victoria's Secret Bombshell. Now this has the sweetest, flowery, sweetheart, girl next door smell. Um, I wear this a ton. And you're probably wondering, if you use it a ton, why is the bottle still full? I just bought it again because I just ran out. So I don't know why, but I always wear this when I go to school. It's a very fresh, and a youthful perfume, I feel. So it's just perfect for school. And I, I literally wear this only to school. So when I graduate, I have to find another home for it. But I love it, and this is definitely my school perfume. Perfume number two. Juicy Couture, oh my gosh. This is actually my favorite. Um, that is why the bottle is completely empty. And uh, I actually have a new one that I haven't opened yet but it is the same exact guy. If I'm like running out of the house and I just need to spray something that I know is reliable, um, the Juicy Couture is my go-to. I absolutely love it. I wear this pretty much everywhere during the daytime. If it's any kind of casual daytime, if I have a dentist appointment, if I have some kind of a meeting, I always wear this. If it's just casual, Juicy Couture is my go-to guy. Now, a lot of you, know this and a lot of you might not know this but I'm an actress in LA so I am going on auditions all the time and a big thing that you're always advised not to do when you go into an audition is to not wear perfume because the casting directors might be sensitive to perfume or some people interpret a little bit of perfume very differently so while one person might actually have a little bit of perfume on someone else might have a ton of perfume on thinking it's a little bit so if you ever decide to act, little pointer, um, you're gonna be advised to not wear any perfume. Now, I I love perfume. So <laughs> I had to find a scent that was so light and so minimal, you almost couldn't smell it, but it just smelled like a nice little spritz of freshness. So my go-to audition perfume is Dream Angels Heavenly by Victoria's Secret. I love this stuff. It's more of, it's almost more of a, like a body mist or a body spray, but it is a perfume. It's super light. It also only lasts about three hours, which is good, because by the time I get from my house to my audition location, it will have worn off. So this is like my audition perfume. Um, I know that's crazy, but I actually have an audition perfume and hey, I've booked a lot of work, so I think it works. <laughs> Alrighty, my fourth perfume is Versace Crystal Noir. Now this has a really plummy, sharp smell. So if I'm ever at an event where I need to, I know this, it's literally like a total mental thing, but to me, this makes me have a sharper personality. So if I'm ever somewhere where I need to be on my game, 99% of the time that's an event, like a networking event, where you know I need to present myself and talk to a ton of people, get contact information, receive contact information. I usually wear my Versace Crystal Noir um, because it's very sharp and I feel like when I wear it that I bathe myself in like a dark, kind of like the same color as the bottle. I think I showed you the bottle, it's super pretty. But it's like a dark plummy purple. Um, and it, that's what it tastes like, is like a sharp, pl or not what it tastes like. I have not ever eaten perfume, y'all. This is what it smells like, is a very dark, sharp, plummy scent. And I only wear this also for um, business events as well. I don't wear this on dates. I don't wear this in the daytime. I don't wear this when I just wanna go hang out with friends. Needless to say, I don't wear this during the daytime unless I really need to get my point across. Alrighty. My go-to, go-to black tie, fancy red carpet event perfume is Silhouette by Christian Siriano. It's also the prettiest bottle that I have too. It's gorgeous. I love this stuff here. I'll take this off to show you. It literally stays like this. Is that not the prettiest thing ever? So anyways, Christian Siriano is one of my favorite designers, um, clothing wise actually, but he does like everything now. And this is his perfume and I love it. I wear it to all of my red carpet events any kind of a black tie event. Um, if I am in a gown 
or a black tie cocktail, I will be putting this on because it is so luxury. I feel like it just says, here I am, I am amazing, and take my photo. That is what this perfume says to me. Um, so it is very full because since I've had it, I've gone to probably 10 to 15 events in the last year or so. So um, yeah, this is my go-to black black tie uh, perfume. I definitely recommend it. It smells like a dream. It smells like if red velvet had a scent. This is what it would smell like. And my last but certainly not least perfume that I love is Night by Victoria's Secret. Um, this is a very sexy spray. So um, this is my date night spray. Now you all know I'm engaged. So I have the same partner at all of my date nights, but I still like to smell like a million bucks for him. So this, here's the bottle, super pretty as well. I love the rhinestones around it. Just a little pop off top. They're all pop off tops, stating the obvious. Um, but this is my date night perfume. It's the kind of perfume you want to wear when you're snuggling because it is, like it's a turn on. So I am keeping it very PG here and I'm not gonna go into details, but it is wonderful um, for dates. It makes me feel like a beautiful, sexy goddess. So um, this is my date night perfume and it's very, it's a very strong scent as well. Like do not wear this to a meeting. It does not wear off fast. Um, if I put it on at seven o'clock, it'll still be on by 3 a.m. So um, just be a little careful with this because it's very strong, very heavy scented. I mean, hence the black bottle. It's not a delicate perfume, but it is my go-to date night perfume. And it's when I just want to feel my most va va voom So those are my six perfumes that I swear by. Most of them I have been wearing for years now. I feel like all of these perfumes have their own very special and unique personality and I love the way I feel in every single one of them. So if you are interested in checking them out, I am posting the links to every single one of them below. So definitely make sure you look them up and um, let me know what you think. If you've actually used some of these perfumes before, I'd love to hear your experiences with the products that I post on my channel. Other than that, I hope you guys have a fabulous day. I hope you enjoyed seeing my six go-to perfumes and maybe they'll become your go-to perfumes as well. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys next time.